All right, let's get something straight right away. If you're still using your iPhone stock in 2025, you're basically using a Ferrari with a governor limiting it to 60 miles per hour. Apple has been hand-holding its users for so long that most of you don't even realize how locked down your phone actually is. And yet somehow, there's still a debate about whether jailbreaking is worth it. Let me break it down for you. Apple users are brainwashed into thinking jailbreaking is dangerous. I can already hear the Apple fanboys in the comments. But jailbreaking makes your phone insecure. It voids your warranty. Why would you jailbreak when Apple gives you everything you need? Stop it. Just stop. These are the same people who act like Apple's walled garden is a feature and not a prison. Meanwhile, Android users have been enjoying actual customization and control over their devices for years. The fact that you have to wait for Apple to graciously give you tiny, basic features, like a customizable lock screen, while Android users have been doing this since 2012, should be embarrassing. And don't even get me started on the security argument. Guess what? Your stock iPhone already collects all your data, and Apple works hand-in-hand -hand with governments worldwide. But sure, keep pretending jailbreaking is the real danger. Let's be honest. Without jailbreaking, your iPhone is a glorified toy. Apple deliberately restricts what you can do, forcing you to play by their rules while making billions off their App Store monopoly. You want to install an app that Apple doesn't approve of? Too bad. You want to change your icons beyond the limited, pathetic options Apple gives you? Nope. You want real multitasking, file management, or system-wide theming? Keep dreaming. Jailbreaking fixes all of this. It unlocks the full potential of your device, letting you customize it however you want. And for the people crying about stability, yes, jailbreaking used to be buggy years ago. But now? Jailbroken iPhones run better than stock ones. You're out here struggling with whatever half-baked iOS update Apple forced on you while I'm tweaking my phone exactly how I want it. If you're reading this and thinking, I don't need jailbreaking, my iPhone works just fine, congrats, you're part of the problem. Apple has trained you to accept mediocrity. Meanwhile, people who jailbreak are out here running custom themes, using features Apple won't introduce for another five years, and actually owning their devices instead of just renting them from Apple's ecosystem. There's no debate. Jailbreaking is absolutely worth it. The fact that people still think it's not just proves how well Apple's propaganda machine works. But hey, if you enjoy living in a lockdown system where you're told what you can and can't do with your own device, go ahead. Just don't come crying when jailbreakers are living in the future while you're still begging Apple for basic features.